Hey guys, welcome back. Um, I'm having such a good time doing all this, pulling all my old cars out, uh, showing you guys the stuff that I got, you know, and, and just reliving some of this stuff myself. I mean, some of the stuff I've had in boxes for nearly 20 years, and it's really, really been cool to pull them out, show them, put them on video, and, and I'm really enjoying myself and just uh, hoping that you guys are enjoying it too. Hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. I'm going to keep doing this. I'm going to do these uh, weekly videos uh, showing you guys what I've got. And uh, so on the display table, we've got a 71 Plymouth Hemi Cuda. That's an M2. This is actually a new release. Uh, it just came out. Uh, I picked that one up at Walmart about a week ago. Uh, also have um, a 1968 Ford Mustang GT390. Uh, that uh, also picked up at Walmart. There it is there. These are really cool. Highly detailed. I really enjoy these. Uh, this one came with black wheels on it. Um, the Hemi Cuda came with three different sets of wheels plus the one that was on it. So I took the wheels that were on the Ford off and replaced them with these. I think these ones look way better than the ones that came stock. You can see in the background we've got some hot country. Uh, these ones were, oh, I think I bought these in 1999. I think they are 1999 limited editions, but I think there was 25,000 castings done in these ones, and I would have got these at Toys R Us uh, then. So we're going to open those up as well, and uh, we'll take a look at those. Let's get some stuff out of the way here. We'll put the turntable back up afterwards. So this one here is uh, Jody Messina. And that one is a, uh, let's see. That is a Pontiac. It's a good question. What is that? Pontiac, that's all we know. This one is a Chevelle. And uh, also from 1999, I got some stock rods. So these ones, boy, these are oldies. Yeah, so again, 1999, limited to, I think, 999,000. Um, they were issued out, um, let's see, probably around the same time. So those ones are from Racing Champions from the 10th anniversary. And around the same time, I would have picked up this one. So that's also a Winner's Circle. Um, so that one's really cool. Rusty Wallace uh, Ford. Get that in focus here for you. So we'll open that one up too. And uh, also picked up a Starsky and Hutch Hot Wheels uh, issue. Now, I think this one, 76 Ford Grand Torino, I think this one came out about three or four years ago. Yeah, 2015 casting. So that probably was available for purchase in stores in probably 2016. So we're going to get the turntable back up here. We're going to open these ones up and uh, get you guys to check them out. Oh. One, two more things. I picked these up at some discount store. These ones are old too, probably uh, from 2007. Uh, Speed Racer, uh, Hot Wheels. So I picked up a Mach 6 and the Mach 5. Both of those ones have uh, those extra parts in them that, you know, I guess, I don't know. This one's the jacks and this one's the saws. Anyway, so let's open those ones up as well because the packaging on those ones not so good. So I would never keep them anyway. So let's get the turntable back up and let's see what these look like out of their case. So first one, let's do the 1970 Chevelle issue number 174. Stock rods with the NASCAR liveries. So this one came with a, uh, a card so the 
you want to see them with the hoods up or not. So kind of a, I don't know, I guess kind of a dragster, eh, maybe not a dragster, but anyway, muscle car series for sure. Those are a lot of fun. And then the 66 GTO, which was a another stock rods NASCAR issue. And... Uh, Again, card, uh, I guess a signature by the driver, I would assume, and uh, again, kind of a cool looking uh, M&M's livery, obviously taken from a NASCAR, the rubber's falling off, I'll fix that later. After that, we'll go back to the other 71 Chevelle. So that's the Hot Country, Ricky Van Shelton. So that comes with a uh, little card that sits behind the little display stand. And there it is. And then, uh, let's see, so this is the other 66 GTO, uh, Jody Messina. From the Hot Country Series Racing Champions 10th Anniversary. And again, a uh, little tag that sits behind the little display case. I guess that kind of just sits inside the display case like that. And. Sure, not a lot of people are going to display these with the hoods up, but I'll leave the hoods up for now. And let's see, we got the Rusty Wallace from the Winter Circle. So this is a 1965 Penske Racing South Ford Galaxy. It's a lot to say. Again, that comes with a, I guess, a Rusty Wallace trading card, it looks like. Look at that Kenner. I don't even know if Kenner's even around anymore. Funny, eh? I think that was a Hasbro company. And uh, so no opening parts on this one. And actually, uh, it looks like it has plastic wheels. No rubber wheels on that. So I thought, well, I would have thought that was a premium. Um, okay, so there's the Ford Galaxy. And let's see, we'll, uh, let's open up the Starsky and Hutch 1976 Ford Gran Torino. <laughs> I love this car. Starsky and Hutch. I love these guys. There it is. That is so cool. Yeah, you gotta love that. You've got to love that. I love the Gran Torino. I think the Ford Gran Torino is one of my favorite, all-time favorite cars. I don't know why, just is. And so let's move on to Speed Racer. And so we've got uh, those little jacks and the car itself. That's kind of neat. I don't know if we can have them on the jacks on the display case or not. Let's try it. Not too tall? No, I think it fits.
Pretty cool. Get that back in focus. Okay. That's really neat. So that's the Mach 5, and then I've got the Mach 6. Again, same scenario. This one comes with a little piece that goes on the car. It's kind of cool too. I'm not sure if I can get that fit on. Let's try. Okay, there we go. So there it is with its little saws. Put that on there. Oop. It's a bit different. So there they are, some long lost Speed Racer Hot Wheels cars. I'm not sure, uh, they were the last two just hanging out there at this discount store. And uh, so I think that about wraps it up for today. Like I said before, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. I'm really enjoying showing you guys all of my cars. More to come. Thanks. Bye for now.